After 57 days of being behind bars, Ronnie Lee Hall of Hueysville has been released from jail. Hall was arrested and charged with murder back in April after he shot three people at his home, killing two of them. Since the beginning, Hall has claimed self-defense. I don't know why he was ever in jail the first day that this was the clearest case of self-defense I've seen in 35 years of practicing law. Everything Mr. Hall said was confirmed by the physical evidence. They came in, they beat him in his home, he got to a gun, he was on his porch, and they were still milling around in his stairwell with a gun when he opened fire and defended himself. Under the law that the legislature passed, you have a right to kill anybody who enters your house unlawfully. According to testimony before a Floyd County grand jury, the home invaders were going to stop at nothing. Apparently the home invaders were clearly under the influence. They were urinating in front of his apartment. And I think the beating occurred because he told them to stop urinating in front of his apartment. And these people were dangerous bullies because of their own criminal conduct in invading this man's house and beating this man up. The Floyd County Grand Jury met on three occasions to hear evidence, statements, and testimony regarding the case. The Grand Jury heard testimony from every person identified by anyone having knowledge concerning this case. After much deliberation, the Floyd County Grand Jury issued a no true bill Wednesday. This means Hall will not be indicted and will no longer face murder charges. Since his release, Hall has had to lay low because of threats made toward him. And you know, on the other hand, even though there are a lot of threats against Mr. Hall, what we have learned throughout this unfortunate situation is Mr. Hall knows how to defend himself. EKB News has reached out to Ronnie Hall for an interview, but he has declined in order to not disclose his whereabouts. Reporting in Prestonsburg for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.